Hey everybody, um, I'm going to make a quick video about uh, depersonalization. Um, I've been watching over the past couple of months pretty much every video on YouTube that has to do with depersonalization. Um, so I'm going to post one up on my own right now. Um, long story short, I got this about four months ago um, from smoking weed. I woke up one morning, smoked a bowl, and was depersonalized for nine days. Um, I actually got out of it and um, for about five days. Then I had a, another anxiety attack on the fifth day, and I'd also been drinking all day. And uh, I've been in it for four months ever since then. So what I've learned from it and how I've been coping with it is um, I kind of came up with my own mantra called, It's Just DP. It's just depersonalization. Um, and what that does, it kind of calms me down because I would get so freaked out when I didn't know what it was. Um, I mean, you can imagine, for those who don't know what depersonalization is, uh, you feel like you're losing your mind all the time. You, you feel like you're just living in this fog. Like, you're not connected to reality. Um, you just feel so disconnected. You feel like you're not a part of anything. You just, like... You just feel like you're dead, and it sucks. It's not a way to live life. You cannot, you don't have that connection, that intimacy, that that just good, relaxed feeling that you're part of something amazing. That's all stripped away from you when you have depersonalization. Um, but one thing it also does is scares the shit out of you and it makes you worry a whole lot about everything and anything question everything I questioned everything um, and I'm a very philosophical thinker um, to begin with you know I, I'm a very deep thinker so it didn't really help um, but you have to just relax you have to not fear it you cannot give in to this feeling of weirdness I mean I wake up in the middle of nights and times and I am just so out of it I don't know where I am what I'm doing I'll be in my own room and I just I don't know what's happening I don't, it, I don't even know where I am and I'll see everything in my room and know it's my room but at the same time I don't know it's my room and it sucks but you know I've learned to just ride it out like it's a roller coaster when I start feeling that way just like whatever no big deal I'll get over this um, you're all gonna get over this like I said I've recovered once before so you all will too and you just gotta hang in there you gotta stay strong um, Basically, one of the tips I want to give you is to try to cut all caffeine out of your diet. Um, all the sugar that you can. I know it's hard, you can't do all sugar, but you need to cut out the majority of your sugar. You need to exercise, you need to get outside, you need to stop staying inside, you need to get out and be a part of society again, and you need to try to just live your life and forget about this. Um, but when you do that, you're going to see big improvements. And you got to just be okay with it, you know? Because even if it goes away, I can tell you it can come back, and it might. And if you fear it coming back, a good chance it might come back. And the way I see it in preventing it from coming back is to not fear it. You cannot care. You got to just like, whatever. You know, just fuck it. And I know that's really hard, but you can do it. So we're all going to get over this. I'm going to get over this, you're going to get over this, my fellow sufferers, you know, I feel for you, and I always will, even when I'm done with this. Anyways, you know, I'll probably make another video soon, but I just want to get one up there and just show you guys that there's, an, there's one more person out there with this. And sadly, there's a lot of people out there with this, and you're not alone. And um, it's going to be okay. You know, we're going to get through this. Just hang in there, right? I'm going to probably make a better constructed video. I uh, want to start some freestyles, and when you have DP, my thoughts are all jumbled everywhere, so, you know, it's not the most fluent video, but, um, I'll get back to you guys, I'll give you an update, like I said, it's already been four months for me, so, I'm hanging in there, I'm still alive, uh, anyways, thanks you guys for watching, stay strong, and, uh, I'll get back to you guys soon, peace.